Hey guys, welcome back to Play Candy. So today we're opening up a, another one of these Wave 2 Winged House Magic Tears series. So this was Kaisi. She was my first doll. My second doll was Leah. We opened up last time. There she is. And today we are opening up our, ooh, let me count, third. So this is our third Wave 2 Winged House series. So let's get straight in. So the houses come in this dark purple or a turquoisey color. They have the golden official crybaby sticker on the top of the house. And here we go. Let's pop her open. Hope for a new one, guys. One, two, three. It's a new one. It's a new one for sure. Brilliant. Okay, guys. So I'm going to have a look at the doll straight away again like I did last time. There we go. We've got Shark. Look at him. Oh, I really like him, guys. What do you think? He looks really, really, he's quite plain colored, but I just love the way his blue hair. And look at his little back. He's got a fin on the back and he's also got a little shark tail. He is super cute. And look at his head. Oh, so this is what I mean. Look at how his bright blue sparkly hair sticks out so nicely. Okay guys, so inside our house we've got our little chair. It's the same as our Winged House Series 1 chair. So you slide on top your little tray. It's like a little high chair with a little tray. And that's in that lovely sparkly blue colour. Here is our check sheet. And there's our first one, Kaizy. There's our second one, Leah. And where's our shark? Oh, he's up the top there, shark. So loads more still to collect. I'm hoping for a Batsy, I think, guys. Okay, here is my sticker sheet for Shark. You can decorate up your house with it or put them wherever you want to. And we've got our cute little blankie. If I show you up close, you can see the glitter, sparkle. I love the way they've given him a pink blanket for a little pop of color. So let's look inside our house. Let's open up our first compartment. This is our sippy cup compartment. And we have got the same as the Wave 1 cups. It's shaped as our winged house and the same colors. And in our first compartment, what do we have here? Ooh, it looks like we've got a surfboard. So our little shark likes to hang 10. Let's let him have a little go on the waves. Okay guys, let's look in the top. Oh, we've got another teardrop. All three of my crybabies have had teardrops. But we've got our blue bibby bow matching our chair. And here is our dummy matching those as well. And up the top, oh, we've got a pair of funky sunglasses. And they are also nice bright pink. So our shark might be quite a plain color, but he's got this lovely bright blue hair and he's got his lovely glasses. Hey, surf's up dudes! Hang ten! Whee! I'm gonna catch that wave! Okay guys, so like I've done on my other two videos with my wave ones, I'm going to show you how this crybaby cries. This the series also cries of blue tears and as I've said a hundred times before the blue dye can discolor the inside of your doll so I'm gonna keep my new dolls lovely and clean and instead I'm going to demonstrate the crying on my trusty little Sasha doll so this is my duplicate Sasha she's gorgeous and clean and this is my first Sasha doll. Look, she's been crying already. Let me dry her tears. But if you can see inside, she's stained a little bit blue. And that's because I've used her to, to cry before. So instead of dirtying up Shark, I'm going to show you on my duplicate Sasha. Okay, so you're going to want to fill your sippy cup up with some water. Squeeze the air out and then put it in the water to suck some water up. And then you're going to lie your doll backwards and squeeze some water into her into her mouth about three or four cups you can see that my Sasha doll already has lots of water inside her I like to give her a little shake or a little swish around to make sure all that blue colors mixed in with your water and then just give her tummy a little squeeze and you'll see those lovely dark blue tears come running out 
Look how bright blue that is. Guys, you can see it makes a bit of a mess on your doll. So when you're finished playing with her, just give her a little face a wipe, remove the plug at the back of her head and squeeze the rest of the water out that you're not going to use because it can stain her body and it can also spill everywhere that you don't want to spill it. So just clean her up when you're finished playing and then you'll be able to use her time and time again. I've used the Sasha doll lots of times to show blue crying and look how blue they still are. Okay guys, that's about all I've got time to show you today. So that was the third of our Wave 2 Winged House series. I hope you enjoyed watching guys. If you haven't already subscribed to my channel, I really appreciate every one of you that hit the subscribe button. And if you enjoyed the video, give us a little thumbs up. And I'll see you guys really, really soon. I'm sending you loads and loads of love. That's all for now. Bye bye guys. Lots of love.